Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I am back with another designer showcase. So let's get cracking. Friends, before we get started, I want to show you how to share. This is a project I created. If you ever create something awesome and you want me to check it out, all you have to do is click this button right here. You can generate a link, you can copy the link, and then you can ship it to me. I am HL Mod Tech on Facebook, Instagram, and Gmail. You can also find me on Twitter. I am HL Tinkercad. If those options don't work for you, don't forget you can also visit hlmodtech.com. I've got a page dedicated to Tinkercad, and I've got a sweet built-in messaging service. You can fill this out with your information and ship it to me almost instantly. Friends, today's design comes from Tinkercad user Dawnfish. Dawnfish shared this fantastic 1972 Ford F100 Tesla killer. Let's tinker this, open it up, and see just what he built. This is another one of those complex designs, which is super cool to watch as it builds. I will speed this up so it happens a little faster as you watch it, but as you can see, this car is completely designed in Tinkercad. Now, Dawnfish said he spent more than three to four months building this. Super proud of it. He's got parts he's used from other users. That is one cool thing about Tinkercad is you can copy and tinker and take things and mod them to an incredible level. All right, everybody, so there is the F100 Tesla Killer 1972. This thing is awesome. Now, before I go any further, let's quickly pop over to the updates. Dawnfish wants to credit John West for the wheels, Thomas Worley for the turbos and various other parts, and credit to Redneck for LS3, Ash Mowat for the battery, Waylon Coffee for the original truck, and as he mentions, there's just too much more to explain. If you check his profile, you'll be able to check out all these pictures. There are so many awesome pictures, but the cool thing about him sharing it with us, we can check it out in the real editor. So, there are all kinds of cool things. Looks like your Lambo is behind me. These are the marks for who he's taken out. That is so awesome. Let's look under the hood. I'm going to do Control H to hide it. This is the sweet engine. There's that battery he was talking about. That is fantastic. It has a Chevrolet in a Ford. Interesting. It's got the turbo. It says Tesla Slayer on the front. That is just bonkers. If we hit F, you can zoom in all the way on all the tiny parts. That is just fabulous. Let's slip around this way and check it out from the interior. This is so cool to see somebody take the interior of a car to such a fantastic level. Love all the details, the partially tipped over can, cool things on the sides. Electric is bad. That is one of the things that Don Fish has mentioned to me. Absolutely abhors electric vehicles and wants to go gas all the way. Friends, one other cool thing I want to highlight is how this vehicle has been aged. Putting dents in it, cutting pieces out where it may have rusted. This is just so cool and it's real easy to see why it took Don Fish about three to four months to actually create it. This is a fantastic design. So many cool details, as he said, more than three or four months to build, and I'm totally impressed. Thank you very much, Dawnfish, for taking time to share. Remember, friends, if you want to see more of Dawnfish's works, you can check out his Tinkercad profile. I will have it down below. There's all kinds of good information about Dawnfish over here, and you can check out the sweet vehicles. Remember, whenever you check out one of these, there are cool images, and make sure you give them a reaction. It's super cool that they're taking time to do this, and this is one of the coolest ways for you to let a creator know you appreciate their work. Friends, I want to remind you one more time really fast. If you ever make something awesome, if you ever make something awesome and want to share it with me, all you have to do is click on this button right here, generate a link, copy the link, and then you can reach out and share it with me on Facebook, Instagram, or Gmail. I am HL Mod Tech on all three of those. You can also find me on Twitter. I am HL Tinkercad. If those don't work for your friends, don't forget you can visit hlmodtech.com. You can check out my amazing Tinkercad page with tons of fun lessons. And then you can also hit the built-in messaging and reach out to me almost instantly. Finally, friends, a big thank you and congratulations on such an awesome design to Dawnfish. Friends, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like, maybe even hit that share button. And of course, if you got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button and like 
last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.